happy Friday. I want to go ahead and go give y'all a job list for this morning. Starbucks is hiring, which is a job I gave on live um, earlier this week and also yesterday. Um, they are closing this April 29th, so please make sure you run and apply. This pay position pays $25.19 all the way up to $42.79. This is a data administer um position what you'll be doing is entering information into the database and coordinate regular and emergency database maintenance to keep information up to date process data changes request and may mod um, modify information related to spreadsheet files or templates so everything that i have highlighted here is some of the things that you'll be doing while in this position also here this is um, who they'd love to hear for hear from so make sure you are tailoring your resume um, based on this and any skills that you see in the job description so um the experience in maintaining a large amount of complex data you should have experience on your resume um doing that also focusing on outstanding customer service you should have customer service experience for this position as well so each bullet point um should be something that is on your resume but it should flow fluently make sure we keep that in mind make sure we are tailoring those resumes so that we are able to get those resumes pulled faster um so that's all that i have for starbucks R.L. Cannon is hiring as well for an informatic data analysis. Um, this is remote all over the United States. Some of the um, responsibility that you'll be doing is um, manipulate large database to identify and summarize trends to inform strategic public health decisions. Um, you will also develop effective data visualization and other tools to communicate key data related to specific healthcare quality issues and select public health priorities. Um, so this is all that you'll be doing right here. Make sure that you pause and read. Make sure this is something that fits what you are looking to do. Um, and make sure the company, you do your research on the company so when you are interviewing with the company, you can talk their language. Um, they do have required qualifications. So this right here, what I have highlighted, this is what we are going to be tailoring our resumes, making sure we have the experience that is necessary for this position. When I say tailor your resumes, you are making sure the skills and the qualifications that these jobs are recommending that you have or requiring that you have in order to get your resume pulled those are the things that you have on your resume these companies do provide equipment so keep that in mind these companies do provide equipment so um, run and apply and do your research on the company make sure i cannot stress enough to make sure that we are doing our research on the company so we can make sure that this is something that we are wanting to uh somebody that we are wanting to work for um total md is also hiring uh total md is a thriving um, company, they're hiring for an administrative assistant, data entry, customer service, so you'll be doing all in one. Um, you'll handle office tasks such as filing, generating reports and presentation and reordering supplies, making travel arrangements such as booking flights, cars, and making hotel and restaurant reservations. You'll be screening phone calls and routing calls to the appropriate party. You'll also be using computers to generate report transcribe minutes from meetings, create presentations, and conduct research. You'll also maintain polite and professional communication via phone, email, and mail, and then uh, make travel arrangements with it, such as booking flights, cars, and all of that good stuff. They do have some requirements listed here, um, a high level of integrity, honesty, and sound judgment, um, strong interpersonal and communication skills, so that should be in your skills on your resume, a strong worth ethic, the ability to manage conflicting priorities, the ability to maintain a positive attitude in a high-pressure environment, and a well-groomed business-like appearance. Um, they do ha um, offer you equipment, and they also do have benefits as well. Um, Google is hiring for a sales excellent lead, a data in um, analysis you do need a bachelor's degree or equivalent practical experience. You do not need a bachelor's degree for this position if you have that experience. You do have to have 10 years of experience in business strategy, operations, and execution. Um, the preferred qualifications they have listed here, um, experience in driving business performance through programs that address GTM. Make sure you guys pause and read to make sure that this is something that you are looking to get into. They are paying $203,000 all the way up to $299,000 plus bonus equity and benefits. Um, and then right here, they have your responsibilities listed out again. Just make sure um, that we are tailoring our resumes. Make sure that this is something that we are looking to do. Make sure this is something that we have experience in. Um, Google is a very strategic company when it comes to these resumes. So you have to make, make sure that your resume is almost picture perfect. Um, not going to lie. Also, the last but not least, um, Paycor is hiring for a customer advocate. 
the payroll advocate. So um, some things that you'll be doing, you'll support customer interactions, performing basic functions within the uh, perform application in a team setting in a contact center environment. You'll act as a frontline triage by taking ownership and troubleshooting the main time sensitive, urgent, and less complex issues. Um, so just but pause and read. Make sure again that this is something that fits what you are looking for. Uh, you must be able to meet or exceed expectations with schedule adherence. So things like that. Make sure this is something that that fits what you are looking to do. Um, they do have some requirements as well. Um, they do have require some requirements as well. You do have to have a bachelor's degree or four years of equitable business experience is required. So that's a requirement. So um, make sure on your resume when you're, you know, saying how long you've been at companies and things like that, make sure you do have at least four years of equitable business experience in, when applying for this position. Also, make sure you have one to two years of supporting customers via phone, one to two years of multi-challenge customer service experience, one to two years of prior facing HCM, and pay core experience is a plus. Um, so make sure that we do our research on what HCM is. I have no idea. I've never worked for a pay company. Um, so I would, I would just do my research on that. Um, proven excellence in customer service and relationship building skills is required. Um, you'll also have to have prior experience with tr transferring knowledge to others in training environment or virtually utilizing online tools such as Zoom, Skype, things like that. They do offer um, incentives. They do offer all of the 401k and the benefits, things like that. This position is paying $16.05 all the way up to $24.70 an hour. Um, so make sure, make sure, make sure we run and apply for this position. Make sure we are tailoring our resumes. Don't forget to tailor your resumes. Resumes are not one size fit all anymore. So make sure we are tailoring those resumes. Um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share the video with anybody, everybody that you think it may help. Don't forget you are able to reach out to me via email if you are needing any assistance at all. My email will be in the description box below as long as the job links that I have gone over today. Right after this uh, video goes up, I will come back with another video. Make sure I get two videos out before I start um, working for the day. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. I greatly appreciate it. And until the next video.